I've been working for for since I've been playing football. Uh, my family's very excited, and I thank them for getting me to this point in time. Uh, it's a it's a great day for um for me as a parent, and I know for her as well. He's um accomplishing all his dreams um, to play college football, and it doesn't matter at any level. But a lot of kids don't get this opportunity, so I'm glad that he's getting the opportunity to go to the next level and play football and get a and get a free education. It feels good to me. Um, he has accomplished um, a lot of obstacles from being told he wasn't going to be able to play on a college level because um, he was too small to play. So for him to um, be able to be offered a scholarship from Artisan Brothers, it's a great feeling for me. And I'm great. I'm happy that he's able to go to college and live out his dreams and get an education and play football. The kid's worked hard since he's been here. Uh, he's, the, he's the model of the type of players that you want to coach. Uh, he never asked for anything. Uh, he went out and worked hard for everything he's got. So today is uh, very, very special. Talk about having the opportunity to play at the next level. Uh, it's great. Not a lot of kids um, had this opportunity, so I'm definitely not taking it for granted. What advice do you give other parents that had to go through last year, you know, being recruited, not being recruited, and having the hopes of playing at the next level? What advice do you have to parents? I would tell them don't, don't as a parent, you just got to keep pushing your son. Um, I think I talked to Coach Verby a lot, and we was talking about how his recruitment was coming late and that it was going, it's going to pick up. And I tried to keep him focused as a father and let him know what's going to come. It's going to come. Don't worry about it. As he kept watching social media, I think social media is one of the, one of the worst things that a kid can do as far as watching other kids get out scholarships. And I just told my son, it's going to come. Just be patient. And then one came. Two came, three. So he had a total of five offers, which I'm just grateful. And I told him, as long as we got one, we secured the bag. So he's getting the education. The most important thing is, and we don't never talk NFL. He's going to school to get an education. And if the NFL comes, they'll find him. So I'm glad he's getting a free education. And then just to keep God first and keep his focus on education and his talents and they'll see you, your, your name and your plays and your talents to speak for itself. How important is it uh, to further your education? It's very important. Um, it's very important for my, just not me, but my family, and also a family if I decide to have one, big for them too as well. All right, bro, what advice do you have for the underclassmen? Uh, just work hard, work harder than everybody else because somebody's always working and they're trying to get the spot, your spot, so work hard all the time. What is it going to take for you to achieve at the next level? Um, just hard work, dedication, believing in God, and trusting Him that He's going to get it done for him. What can we expect from you in the future? You can expect great things. Um, definitely going to work hard, get my education, and just the best of me I can give. Hutchinson.
Both.